the hook to be St. Louis own, taken by Affleck, and he stands behind the net. Just underway with our all-important hockey game for the Chicago Blackhawks. Back to the blue line, and Redmond passes intended for Boulderab. It was out of his reach, and Affleck has it off the backboard. 18 minutes and 30 seconds left to play in the first period. No score. Neither goaltender has been tested as yet. Redmond with the loose puck off the center line, off the far board. Leads on right wing, intercepted by Berenson. And Berenson leads ahead to plot to Berenson with the hot blue line. A block pot shot is broken up by Bill White. Rebound into the far corner and Dennis Hall. Checked along the backboard and put down. And the puck is free behind the Blackhawk net. And now it's on the backboard. Right in front of the referee, Wally Harris. Into the near corner, put to the side of the net, let out and throw it to Boulderet. Pairs it away off the near board and taken by Pitt Martin. Martin left wing lead to Boulderet. Boulderet to the center line, to the blue line. Boulderet leading to Dennis Hall, broken up by Affleck. At the left wing position and dumped out through center right and in the Hawk zone. To the near side and Bill White at the Hawk blue line. Off the near board, Bill White's pass is deflected by Plot. Deep into the St. Louis zone and taken there by Affleck. Behind by Redmond up the center line. Redmond back to the center line. To the blue line. Left wing lead to Boulder. Boulder with a slap shot. Deflected by the rebound. It's down. There we go. Come back! 
came back to poke it away from Johnson into the net. At 3.32, and the Hawks lead it by three, four to one. Long shot from the face-off, saved by Esposito, the weapon behind the net. Away by Smith, let it be. Hockey is the ultimate goal of every player, but do you know who scored the three fastest goals? It was Val Mosienko of the Hawks in 1952, third period, New York leading 6-2. Mosienko scored his first experience, what to reach for first. Hands the cool, crisp beer from the land of sky blue waters. Jake Luck scoring those goals. They call him Dave on the PA. Yeah, the line. Hot zone to wrestle on the far side. Power play hockey for Chicago. Coral to the blue line. Dumps it over. Grabbed by Flaker. Can't clear it. Russell with a long shot. Go! Mackey. 
Led to the near side, up the center line, and Russell is on it for Chicago. Twelve seconds left on the St. Louis penalty as Russell dumps into the far corner, rebounds to the side of the net. And Barkley Plager into the far corner, checked by Mackey. Now Makita off the foul board, puts it back into the far corner, but on the backboard, and tripped up and put down was Coral. No penalty call. And the penalty now to St. Louis is over. Coral has it in the far corner. He kicks it along the backboard. Makita centers it out, deflected into the crease. And Johnston holds on, and Coral into the slot. Hooked to the far board by Wilson and picked up by Wilson. By Unker, throws it off the near board to Coral, and Coral dumps it out to center ice and takes a shot from Wilson at the same time. That center ice, Unger with the puck, deflected by Bill White, and picked up by Wilson. He has to retreat inside his blue line to the far board. Now Unger off the far board. Twelve minutes left in this game. Yeah. Up by Leftley to the far board, back to the blue line, and Affleck. Into the far corner, now to the far point, and here's Affleck with a shot and a save by Esposito. The puck is in the crease and under the Chicago goaltender as the whistle blows. I don't think Esposito knew where it was, and I think Dale Talon believed that. Good Talon and Talon's pass comes right back to it, and on the second effort, he clears at the point off the point man at the far point. Blanks and over the blue line, Barrettson coming into the side of the net, drops it back into the slot. And a tipped back to the blue line, let in front, tipped in, deflected wide to the right side as Leftley almost had a tip in. Now the puck along the backboard, Leftley in the far corner, bringing it along the near board, dropping it back to Affleck at the far point, and dropped again to Affleck, Leftley in, into the slot, deflected away by Martin from Barrettson. Now Barrettson along the backboard, wanting to lead it out. He has it right out through the crease, grabbed by Pitt Martin, and Pitt Martin drops it, and he clears. Any pressure on the part of the St. Louis Blues trying to pick up a power play goal. They trail by three. 50 seconds left in the penalty to Marks as Affleck dumps it back into the hot zone. Off the far corner, taken by Dennis Hull behind the net. Hull into the near corner, along the near board to Martin. Martin back to Hull, and Hull moving the center right to the blue line, making the slap shot, trying to beat Affleck. Carries into the far corner. He centers it, but Unger is there. And Unger picks it up and skates it out to his blue line, to the center line, to the hot blue line. Gary Unger. Now he drops it on the right wing and picked up there by Plant. Hooked away nicely by Magnuson and grabbed by Talon, and Talon clears the length of the ice. 20 seconds left on the Chicago penalty. Unger behind the St. Louis net, coming out of the left side. Power play continuing for the Blues. From the center line, faking his Unger, but he can't bring it over the blue line. His team would have been way offside. Led to the far board, just inside the blue line, and Makita pokes it away from McMillan out to center ice. And the shot by Hess deflected into the far corner, and now the penalty to Marks is over. And the puck deep in the Hawks zone to the backboard. Led back to the blue line, and away from everybody, it slides onto the stick of Eddie Johnston. His own blue line by Sheehan gets by one. Sheehan leading in front, and Roby with a shot to the goal! Gets away 
from Johnston to McMillan on the far board. McMillan still in his own zone. Now he leads it to the near side and gas off. Dumps it down on the deflection to the stick of Esposito and Esposito. Pokes it behind the net to Redmond on the backboard. Now he takes it behind the Hawk net. Throws it around the near corner on the near board. Trying to get it ahead was Martin. Now it is. Off the boulder round to the center line. Boulder round to the blue line. Trying to beat Affleck. Here's his shot. Broken up by Affleck and the rebound is taken by gas off and thrown ahead of McMillan. Out to center right, let on the left wing for Rekasi. Over the Hawk blue line on the near board, being checked by Martin. The puck in the near corner, and still on the near board of the Black Hawk zone. Rekasi and Martin, loose puck to Bill White. Throws it behind the Hawk net to Redmond. Redmond around the far corner, and it bounces off the dasher. It's intended for Dennis Hall, and it rolls out to center ice, and the Blues will have to clear. Near corner, and Plot starts skating it out. To his blue line to the center line. The Hawks are changing on the fly. Plot brings it over the blue line, checked away by Talon. Loose puck to Nikita. And Nikita leads it off the near board to Coral. Coral at the center line, dumping it in deep to the far corner of the St. Louis zone, and Affleck is there on the interception. Affleck Hansen poked out by Rhoda, and we have the arm up raise, the penalty coming up against the Blackhawks. Rhoda, as it's poked out by Coral, the whistle blows, and that will be a tripping call against Darcy Rhoda of Chicago. A coach Hansen and cleared by Coral on the backhand, back to center ice and under. In the center ice position, the puck is dumped back by Makita into the St. Louis zone. And Coral clears back into St. Louis Heights. And behind him to the left wing, but Mackey breaks that up at the blue line and puts it right back into the St. Louis zone, and that's the Hawks' game plan with that four-goal lead. Just to keep them back in their own zone if they can, especially being down by a man. The puck dumped into the Hawk corner, and Esposito with a big stick clears it the length of the ice. Forty seconds left on the penalty to Darcy Rhoda. 4.55 left to go in the game. Six to two, Chicago. Unger to the center line of the Hawk blue line on left wing. Jack there drops it to Irvin. Irvin tripped up right in front. No penalty call. Berenson digging forward on the near board of the Hawk zone. Back to the blue line. And Hess couldn't get a shot away. Here's Unger with a shot from the far right wing. Wide behind the Hawk. That's picked up by Mackey. The Hawks are two on two. Mackey over the blue line. Left wing lead to Martin. Martin is down and off the post. Lifted it high and it went off the post to the right of Eddie Johnson. The Hawks were so close to a shorthanded goal. Drawn into the Hawks zone. Into the near corner and along the backboard. It's Russell. Interception throws to Martin off the far board. And Martin skates it out to the Hawk blue line. And out of the penalty box comes Rhoda. And he was just overlapped by Martin at the blue line. And Rhoda pokes at it. He collides heavily with Unger. And Unger swings around and slaps Rhoda with a stick. And he's put down. No penalty call. Now we have a penalty call. 1975. That face off now. To the left of Johnston and the draw right in front. Sheehan kicks at it. Can't get a shot underway. Drops it back to the blue line. Power play hockey for Chicago. Sheehan coming in on left wing. The shot broken up right back to Sheehan. Sheehan centers the flicked away on the side of the net. Pops up into the air. Back to Mulvey. Mulvey to the blue line and Russell. Russell to Mulvey on short right wing. He is checked from the rear. Carries into the near corner. And Mulvey skates it behind the net. Checked by Smith into the far corner. And now Sheehan trying to get to it, but Mulvey's on top of it as he's down on the ice. One piece off outside the St. Louis blue line of a draw into the blue zone and cleared into the hot zone. 127 left on the Unger penalty. Now Dale Talon at his blue line to the center line. Dale Talon to the blue line of St. Louis. Continues to carry, leading to Sheehan. Off the backboard, Sheehan carries behind the net. Leads to Mulvey. Mulvey to the side of the net. Has to kick the puck behind the net. Center down in front of Zinkler. Was just about a half a foot away from a hat trick. Look at the near point of the St. Louis zone. Russell pokes it to Mulvey. Poked away by Sanderson. Back to center ice and Sheehan has to wait for the Hawks to clear. Now Sheehan from center ice trying to get by him. The blue line can't do it. Loose puck goes to Russell. And Russell at center ice. 53 seconds left on the St. Louis penalty. Dallin outside the blue line gives to Degler at the far point. And Degler's pass on to let the boulder out and it's let out through center ice and gets away from Talon deep into the Hawks zone. Out of that is Esposito for Talon. The Blackhawks, two minutes and 40 seconds away from the tops in the Con Smythe division. Center ice play, the red to the blue line, trying to break by. Can't do it, he's put down in the slot. Loose puck to Martin. Martin will be shot to the goal! the upper left-hand corner of the net. 
pulled the trigger and rammed number seven home for Chicago tonight. And that's number 32 on the season for Pitbox. Ready for the face off the center line. The power play goal for Chicago. They've got it wrapped up. Penalty box is empty. Boulderab assisting on the goal. That's 17-31. Now Boulderab at the center line. Brings it to the blue line. Pops away from him. Back to the Hawk blue line of Dick Redmond. Redmond shoves it back out the center ice and it gets away from gas off just inside the St. Louis zone but it's picked up by Recasey. Recasey throws to the far side and it's over the glass and up into the seats on the far side. Hull at the blue line. And Hull the center ice to Bill White. Bill White to the blue line trying to break by. Right wing is shot as wide to the left side. Rebound to the far board. Poked at by Boulder Ave. Boulder Ave and Patey. And Patey has it now off the far board. One minute and 35 seconds left for the Blackhawks before Stanley Cup play in the quarterfinal round. Boulder Ave to the center line. Right wing lead intended for Martin just out of his reach into the St. Louis zone. Grab thrown off an airboard back to the Hawks hall and Bill White. Bill White to Dick Redman. Redman a right wing lead that's popped away by Gassoff. Back into the Black Hawk zone. And Bill White into the near corner of the Hawk zone. Throws it behind the net to the far corner. Intercepted by McMillan. McMillan has it off the far board. And McMillan into the slot to Patey. Patey with a shot. A save by Esposito. And he jumps on the puck to smother it. Patey won't have a better opportunity all year long. Or all next season, probably. He was right in the goal mob. I would say possibly about 12 feet away from Makita and had a chance to lift it up uh, and get it past Esposito. I mentioned uh, half by step and a save by Esposito. One minute left in the long season. Off the far board, Dinkla to the blue line. Dinkla trying to drop it back, but it's stolen away on the deflection. And Plot comes back to the Hawk blue line, leads it into the Hawk zone, and Vint Martin intercepts and gives to Dinkla. Dinkla at center ice, written out of the play, gives it to Martin. Martin dropping it back into the Hawk zone to Dallas. 40 seconds left. 7 to 2, Blackhawks. Near board play on the Hawks zone for Russell. Russell's pass deflected, comes right back to him. He gives to Talon on the far side. Dale Talon wheeling around. Far corner of the Hawks zone. Leads it out to center ice. 25 seconds left. Intercepted by the Blues at center ice. And deflected to the far board. And Talon in the Hawks blue line. Check. Right point. Loose puck in the far corner. 15 seconds left. Now Russell. Keeps it out. And here come the Hawks leading out. Four got two. Dinkla over the blue line. Dropping it back to Nikita. And no connection made. Five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. The Black Hawks win it. We win it. We win it. We win it. And listen to this crowd of standing ovation. Talon trying to dig for the puck. Finally gets control of it. Leads it 
it out to Sonny Rice to you. March and March brings it over the blue line. Digging for it and over skates it on the far board. And it's picked up by Kapustin. Now the Russians moving back out to center right with 14 seconds left in the Chicago penalty and Rapustin takes the shot to flush it over the glass behind Esposito into the seat. <laughs> Bringing it out over the blue line as he passes to Lebanon to the side of the net and Esposito breaks up the play with the big stick. And Mulvey leads it out to Nikita. The Hawks two on two. Nikita for blue line left wing leads it in. It's all flipped up and the goal! Russell. Now Russell starts moving it out of the Blackhawks zone. Right wing lead at center ice is broken up. 
And taken by Kuznetsov, but Kuznetsov gives it to Kapusta, and he can't get a shot away. Loose puck to Sheehan. Around behind the net. Sheehan leaves it off the far board, and Jennifer Denisov, and that is stolen away. And the Russians control the puck. Right in front of the shot is deflected by Bill White, just wide of the right, and Bill White has been shaken up. The puck is popped through, center ice it all the way down to the wing zone, and Bill White is whipping off the ice to the Blackhawk zone. As the whistle blows, it's an icing call against Chicago. Left to Esposito, and the puck pulled out of there by Russell, and the Hawks come back three on three. Roto over the blue line, can't get by, is checked, and the puck to the backboard. And Russell digging for it, and it's clear, past Sheehan at the far point, out to center ice to the Hawks zone on the far side, and Murray. Leads it off an airboard, intended for Bordelow, checked away on the play, and the puck is picked up by Anderson. Anderson leads into the slot, and the shot by Lebedev is deflected wide to the right side, it goes to the backboard, let out and pop, and picked up by Rota. The Hawks come back three on three, Rota over the blue line, left wing lead to Sheehan, he's under right on the play is broken, and Sheehan is taken into the far board by Tieran. And the puck is dug three off the far board of the Russian zone, and brought out to center ice by Dosti Yuslev. And he brings it over the blue line on the right wing. Leads on the left wing now. Right in front, deflected away by Portal. Good defensive play, and Murray has the loose puck. And Murray shoves it out to center ice. It gets away from everybody and all the way down to the backboard. Rota is there to touch it and complete the offside play. Eight minutes and 30 some seconds left to go in the hockey game. Four to two, Russians. Puck into the Russian zone. Nikita digging for it, can't catch up to it. And the wings bring it out along the airboard. Out to center right to the Hawk blue line. Goes Shatman, and he throws to the far corner. Picked up there by Slavonov. And up to the near point, broken up by Martin, taken by Coyle. The Hawks two on two. Coyle with a flat shot, and a save by Sidelnikov. The puck behind the net. Poked into the far corner. Mark's trying to dig it out. Can't do it. Gets some help from Martin, but the puck is poked away from him. Martin picks it up, puts it into the slot, and it's intercepted by Turin for Russia. And he leads it ahead, and out the center right to the hot zone comes Yukashev. Yukashev's pass deflected to the far corner, taken by Talon. Picked up by Martin, back to Talon along the backboard. Both behind the hot net into the near corner, and Murray. Murray shoves it ahead to Coral. Coral to Martin at center ice. Martin continues to carry. Tried to pass it in at hand on the pass. Luck is picked up by the Russians in their own zone. The Blackhawks' enemy, not only the Russians here tonight, but now becoming the clock. They trail by two with seven minutes and 20-some seconds. Here's a shot by the Russians, and it was wide. It was Slalomov who got that shot underway. Now March back to the blue line, leads ahead to Sheehan. Sheehan returns to March over the blue line. Flat shot, and a save by Fidel Nikoff. He got a piece of it. The puck on the airboard as Mulvey slips, falls down, trying to dig it off an airboard of the Russian zone. And the puck popped up into the air, grabbed and Bill White back on the ice, can't hold it at the airport, and it's into the Chicago zone deep. Into the air corner. Redmond is there to touch it, and that is an icing call against the wing. Kapiustin, who you call center, and the draw to the wings. Can't clear past Bill White at the near point. And White with a wrist shot that's turned away by the goaltender. Loose puck behind the net. Degler trying to dig it out. Fred is out of front, and Dennis Hall couldn't get a shot on their way. He was being hooked. The puck is center ice. Brought into the black hawk zone. Redmond digging for it, along with Kapustin. And Kapustin put down by White. And another player put down by Redmond. And now the penalty is coming up. A holding call against Dick Redmond. And is he angry? If you miss Johnny White. Here yeah, comes Tony. Pokes it into the far corner. Dennis Hall. Bats it along the backboard. Picked up by Russell. And Russell takes a check from the side. And they freeze the puck in the backboard. Behind and to the left of Tony Esposito for the upcoming face. I was mentioning Scott by Russell and Phil the right to the ice, but it's on to the stick. But the goal is in. Dennis Hall was tripped up and set of ice, really put down. Listen to the crowd. Boy, they are happy with it. And the puck out of the stick of Fidel McCoff, and he drops it off at the left side. Dennis Hall was tripped up and set of ice, no penalty call. Set of ice play brought in by the Russians on the left wing. It goes to the near board, and Yakushev taken out of the play, and it's grabbed and thrown by the Blackhawks back into the Russians. 120 left of the penalty to Redmond. Redmond went for holding at 13.28. Center ice play for the Russians. Brought over. Went back into the slot. Here's a quick shot and a save by Esposito. The lead on to the far corner. Talon tried to clear. Loose puck behind the Blackhawk net. Grabbed by Russell and Russell on the backhand. Clears the zone. One minute exactly left of the penalty to Redmond. Four to two in favor of the wings over the Chicago Blackhawks as the Hawks are running out of time. Five minutes and 20 some seconds left to play in the game. And moving into the Blackhawks zone come the Russians. Thrown behind the net into the near corner. Taken there by Yakushev. Back to the near point. Now to the far side. Taking the slap shot. It's a shot. And a save by Esposito. And he stretches himself out with some help from Russell to hold the puck. If you think the Blackhawks have been 
Bowman pulled Randall exec on the boards, and Delamore had trouble getting up. He was doubled over. Brad laid it to it, and he's heading for the penalty box. He uh, tried to show the Russian referee what he was doing on that and uh, tried to justify what he was doing, but the uh, referee looked the other way, and so Frank goes for two, and the Blackhawks will be a man-man tie, and they're only a minute and 40-some seconds left in this game, and now the Soviet wings will have the managed fan advantage for the 12th time in this game. The Blackhawks have been penalized 12 times now. The Soviet wings have been penalized six times, and there is the story of this hockey game because they have scored three power play goals and one goal when they were uh, a man down, both teams a man down. Face off of the Blackhawks zone. Power play hockey again for the Russians. The puck to the side of the net. Cleared away by Marks to Redmond and Redmond. Shoves up the length of the ice. The Blackhawks running out of time, and they have run out of men. Find themselves in trouble throughout the game because of penalties called. Now the Russians taking plenty of time coming out of their own end. Out to center ice comes Lebedev. Lebedev to the center line, decides to wheel around, and just like they're killing a penalty, they have the manpower advantage. And almost deflected away by Makita. And the puck out to center ice and gets away. The pass was intended for Anderson, but it bounced over his stick with less than a minute to play in the game. And that is an icing call against the Russians. The Russians have a far-flung system where they draw their champion from. Usually, the Central Army team, which will be playing Boston, is the winner, although the Soviet wings were saying tonight have won twice. They finished second last year in the Soviet playoff system. The major league where the wings and the Central Army team are consists of 10 teams. Then there's a first division with 14 teams, a second division with 28 teams, and they have a playoff between all of them at the end of the year. Face off in the Russian zone, and the draw, taken by Rasko, put down by Makita, out to center ice, but the loose puck is grabbed there by Repinian. Repinian moves it out to center ice and now drops it back to the blue line. Taken by Kuznetsov. Intercepted at center ice by Repin. Repin to Makita over the blue line. Makita with a slap shot. His stick was checked and pulled the puck far on the left. Thrown by Repin behind the net. Into the near corner of the Soviet zone. Off the near board. Picked up there by Kapustin and led around behind the net to the far corner and Marks is on it for Chicago trying to center. He does center but it's deflected away by the Russians and they own the puck. Cutting out is Rasko to the blue line to the center line of the Hawk blue line. He's dropping it back to Kapustin. Kapustin into the slot. Now back to Kuznetsov into the slot. He pokes it into the far corner and recovers his own pass. And Redman puts the shot as to Kuznetsov. And we're running out of time as March starts bringing it out, winding from his own zone. A long slap shot and a grab by Sedelnikov. And there's the siren. And the Soviet wings have defeated the Blackhawks. There's the end of the game with a final score. The Soviet wings. Chicago Blackhawks 2. Two value hardware stores can show you a simple way to do a simple way to make your home heating system cost less.